Hi everyone, today we are going to take a look how to set up the log stash. Basically, in XStack, we have log stash, Elasticsearch, and Kibana. And the log stash can collect the data from many fields like MySQL table, Mongo database, or CSV format. And uh, we are going to output to the Elasticsearch, and the Kibana can visualize data in the Elasticsearch in PyChart or the particular bar chart, many types of the visualization. So the log stash can get the input from many fields like MySQL and Mongo database. And we are going to have the example getting the data from CSV on next tutorial. And also those many databases have different format and we need to filter it out to something field that we want in the Elasticsearch. So we have the filter in log stash like change the text field, field as a string field or as a data field. Like if the, the year field in the CSV, it's just string, but we want this year as a date format. Then we can change the format from this filter in the log stash. We will see the example in the next, next video. And the log stash has the output. Output will give the output um, to the standard out like the monitor or we can give the output to the elastic search. We will see the example in next slide. So you can download the log stash, the latest version from the elastic search website like here. So currently the version 5.1.1 is the latest version. I'm going to download this one. And once you download it, you can install here. And make sure that before you install, you should have the, the Java in your OS. Like you can check Java minus version and I have the 1.8 version. So I'm ready to install the Logstash in my OS. And here you can see I have the, the Logstash. And I'm going to install this one using the store dpkg and um, minus i and log stash name here. I already installed, so I'm not going to install here right away. And then once you install, you need to configure log stash. So this is kind of basic of log stash config file. We have the input and output. I skipped the filter here because in this tutorial, we don't need a filter, but we are going to see if we have just this simple input std in and output std out. So std in going to get the input from my keyboard and the output standard out will show the output in your monitor. So now we have the config file. I'm going to run log stash minus f and run with this config file, which is just to have the empty standard in and output as empty standard out. So if you say hello, you can see the output is hello on the monitor. And if you give the input from your keyboard, like you are ready to go next step, as you can see, the monitor is showing that the, you are ready to go to next step. And the uh, log stash is ready. I put this one by using keyboard and uh, as you can see the monitor is showing that log stash is ready. So this is a basic config of log stash. On the next video, I'm going to show you how to output to the Elasticsearch. That's pretty much it. Thank you and I will, show, I will see you on the next video.